will ever prosper. Amen. It doesn't say that things won't come against you. It says when they come against you, they may form, but they're not going to prosper. Yes. It's because our God is on the throne. He has no rival. He has no equal. He's in, I love to think about this. God is in control even when sometimes our circumstances seem out of control. God knows the end from the beginning. The scripture says he's already written every day of your life in his book. Let me assure you, your book ends in victory. So if you're not in victory yet, you keep moving forward because you're coming into a new chapter. As Victoria said, I really believe the, the battle takes place in our mind. Victory or defeat, it starts right here in our mind. And, you know, we have things come against us. And if we go around thinking, well, it's never going to change. and I'll never get well. I don't know why this is happening to me. That's going to keep you where you are. It's going to keep you discouraged, keep you from seeing God's best. But if you'll just make that switch in your mind, yes, things are coming against me, but I know it's not going to prosper. I know God's still on the throne. I know what's meant for harm. God's turning to my advantage. You've got to have victory starts in your mind. If you'll program your mind the right way,